everybody, it's Allie and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you guys are new. Before I get into today's video, I wanted to quickly say that I am not in my normal location. I am actually staying with some friends right now. So that is why I have a different background. The lighting is spectacular though, let me tell you. Way better than when I'm at home because at home I have to use artificial lighting and right now I'm using natural lighting. On the other hand, I am sorry for any extra noises you guys hear outside. This video is probably going to be filled with a lot of TMI just to let you guys know. So if you aren't into this kind of stuff and hearing about bodily fluids, I would exit now. I won't be offended. But with that being said, let's just get into today's video. So as you guys can see from the title today, I'm just going to be talking about my experience with kidney stones. If you guys are following me on my other social media accounts such as Snapchat and Instagram, then you already know what's going on. But for those of you who aren't, I highly recommend going and following me. My Twitter and Instagram are just at Allie's underscore underscore life. And then my Snapchat is just Miss Allie Gator. They're always linked down below. But basically about a week ago, I ended up in the emergency room on a Friday night due to what we now know were kidney stones. And I figured I would just come on here and talk about my experience and tell you what it was like. So for those of you who don't know what kidney stones are, basically they are just calcium deposits that can get stuck in your kidneys and eventually you do pass them. However, some people aren't able to pass them and end up having to have surgery. In my case, I am lucky and they actually passed and I actually have them right here. In here, I have about five stones, two of which are pretty big. I have been staying with some friends for the past week and on last Thursday, we went to Target and as we were leaving, I went to the bathroom. For those of you who know me in real life, you know that I am constantly going in the bathroom. I have the bladder of about a squirrel and I'm always peeing. So we were leaving Target and I went to the bathroom and peed and that was the last time I peed for about 24 hours. 24 hours goes by and I started getting this horrific pain in my back and I mean it was awful. I had all this pain in my right flank which is just your right backside and it wasn't going away. And so then we went to the hospital and then when they finally saw me I ended up getting two ultrasounds done. So on the ultrasound they did see a couple of pockets which they assumed were kidney stones. Eventually I was able to pee at the hospital and they did a urine test and everything like that and it came out that I did not in fact have a UTI. So basically they assumed it was kidney stones and that's what they diagnosed me with and said that they should pass within 48 hours. I was sent home with these funky looking funnel things that have weirdo screens on them. So every time I went to the bathroom I had to catch my urine and sure enough I ended up passing five. Let me tell you it hurt so bad and with each couple hours that went by the pain kept getting lower and lower and lower until finally it was basically just all in my pelvic area and that's how I knew I was passing them which is good and as of right now I'm pretty sure I've passed all of them and I'm feeling pretty good but that was my experience if you guys have any questions leave them down below maybe I will do a kidney stone Q&A if I get enough questions if you guys have ever had kidney stones let me know your story in the comments down below I hope you guys liked this video if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and like I said earlier be sure to follow me on my other social media accounts that way you can stay up to date with what I am doing when I am off camera I hope you guys like this video and I'll see you guys next time bye guys Bye.